Good morning and welcome back to another video. It is currently 6.28 a.m. I am getting kind of a late start to my day. George actually goes to work a little later today, so it's really nice that we were able to sleep in. I know this is considered sleeping in, which is crazy. But I'm gonna go to my 7 a.m. class at F45, get a workout in, so he gets to take Alex to school, which is really nice. I don't have to worry about any of that. So today, I'm actually getting ready to go on a trip. I'm not going on a work trip, though. We are going to El Salvador, which is where I'm from, and this time I thought I would bring you guys along and show you guys what we do, show you a little bit of where I'm from and uh, where I was born and all that. So we're just taking the weekend to go over there to visit my family. So if you're new to my channel, my name is Allie and I'm an Orlando-based flight attendant and I vlog about my life as a mom, as a flight attendant. I sprinkle a little bit of lifestyle in here. If you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. And then also make sure to follow me on TikTok and Instagram. I pretty much post there every single day. So when I'm not posting here, you can find me there. Okay, it is 6.29, like I said, and my class starts at seven. So I'm drinking this Alani New pre-workout and then I'm gonna leave here in a, in a few minutes so that I can make it on time to class. <laughs> Just left F45, my goodness, today was rough. We did have the option of doing either upper body or lower body, but I ended up doing upper body because I do lower body most of the time at the gym. It was intense, but it was good, I needed that. So we're going home right now, get the boys ready for the day, and then get our day started. Okay, so I'm all ready for the day. I got dressed, I'm gonna go get the boys here in a little bit, but I'm wearing these new pants that I got in from Halara. So I am partnering up with them once again. I absolutely love working with Halara. I love their clothes. And these pants are probably going to be some of my favorites. These are going to be perfect for the summer right now that it's spring too here in Florida. And I, I, I don't even know what to say about these because these are so nice. I saw them on the website when I was placing my order and I thought they would be cute, but once they're on, they're just so much better. I got them in a size medium. I really like the length of them. And I'm just wearing it with the bodysuit in these sandals right here. I've been able to work with Halara for about, this is probably my fourth time working with them. And I show you guys that I wear their athleisure clothes to the gym or just for regular days. They have clothes for pretty much every occasion. As you can see, they even have clothes that you can wear for day to day, not just athleisure, which is so nice. The quality is amazing. And then the price is also very good too, which I can appreciate. A lot of their materials are very similar to some expensive brands that I have too, for a fact, fraction of the price. So I'm gonna show you guys what else I got. This next one is probably one of my favorites. This is a tank top that I can definitely see myself wearing, especially to the gym. It is a little bit bigger on me, so I would have probably gone down to a small, but this is a medium. Let me show you guys the back. This is what the back looks like. It's so cute. It's so nice. Very, very flattering. I know the name of this right here so you guys can see it, but oh my goodness, I absolutely love this one so much. Again, I love the back. I also got it in this color, and this one is actually a small, which I'm definitely glad that I got a small. And just this color is just so, so beautiful. Then I got this tank top right here. It's a crop top, which is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but it feels very comfortable. I got this in a size medium. I don't know if you guys are able to see, but I'm also wearing some cargo pants that are a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I actually really, really like them. This is what they look like. So with some like platform sneakers, I feel like this would look really cute. Halara also has just regular clothes too. Like they don't only have athleisure, which is pretty nice because you get a variety of things that you can choose from. This next thing I'm gonna show you is way out of my comfort zone, but that's what I like about working with Halara is that I'm able to kind of test out the waters and step out of my comfort zone a little bit. They sent over this tennis skirt. Like this is not something that I would probably wear. I know tennis skirts are in right now, so this would be a good one to look into. So I am gonna leave a link to this one down below and it does have shorts. 
so you're a little bit more covered, which is nice. I haven't worn a tennis skirt since I was in high school when I played tennis, because I actually played tennis in high school. And it's been a very long time since I've worn one of these. <laughs> and these, I wasn't sure at first when I first saw them, honestly. I'll be honest with you, I wasn't sure about these at first, but I feel like these would be really good for like a pool party, to take to the pool, just for like a little bit of a summer look. I also got these in black and they're the slit open wide-legged pants, which kind of like them, not gonna lie. I, again, was not sure about this one, but I actually like it. I feel like it's really cute. It's a cute spring option as well as like a summer option and especially living here in Florida. So this is gonna be really nice to have. I always complain that I don't have dresses and now I have one, so this is good. It's very flattering up here and here with the band and this is what the back looks like. So I'm going to leave a link in the description down below so you guys are able to check out Halara. I absolutely love Halara great quality items working with them has just been amazing so thank you so much to halara for sponsoring a portion of this video and don't forget to check out the link so you're able to pick up some stuff from halara as well okay, so i'm making a protein shake right now and i have some clean simple eats cake batter i add in i added some collagen some fiber and some oat milk and i'm also going to add strawberries and bananas we're actually trying a screen detox here at home so i bought the boys some tony boxes so that they can have screen free entertainment and as you can see it's a little it's a little hectic <laughs> It is 7.22 a.m. Texas time and we decided to stop by Starbucks to get some coffee because we were up so early. I didn't even catch you guys up but we kept snoozing our alarm and we woke up later than we needed to. Luckily everything was so smooth when we got to the airport. We had to check in bags. We normally don't check bags because we're flying standby but we're taking some gifts for my family so we decided to just check in our bags and that obviously takes a while but security was normal. I couldn't go through KCM because I am playing international so I had to go through normal security. That went smoothly too. We had our seats ready by the time we got to the gate so I'm telling you everything went great but we were tired so we're getting some Starbucks now and then now we're gonna try and go to a lounge before we have to go to our flight. Our flight doesn't leave till like 12 p.m. or something like that and then we'll head on over to a set of lunch. Okay so it's a lot later. We've actually been hanging out at the KLM lounge for a while. I did a little bit of editing and I uploaded a few things to TikTok and Instagram. And then now I am at a minute suite. So it's pretty much like a little hotel room that you get at the airport. So if you have the priority pass, you are able to get one of these rooms for free technically. And you're only here for an hour. So I'm gonna continue editing. We're going to eat because we're starving. I don't know why we didn't eat at the KLM lounge. We were just there, just getting some work done. So our flight boards at 11.30, I believe, and it's like around 10.30, so we have to leave soon. And it's actually oversold by one. We are number one and number two on the standby list, so we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we make it on. If not, we're gonna try another airline because we do have contracts with other airlines that we're able to fly on. We're gonna try Avianca if we don't get on my airline. So we'll see what happens. That you doing fine cause you got me I don't wanna break your little bubble But you gotta wake up to reality Cause I can see in your eyes Your head is full of dreams Tears are a proof of failure You just gotta let them flow without judge Good morning, it is the next day I am still here at my aunt's house we are actually getting ready to go out to go have some breakfast and then go on a boat just to go on a lake and probably get some lunch. We're gonna meet up with some more family, hang out, catch up, and I'm 
so happy to be here. Every time I come here, it's just so nostalgic. Like this house right here, I grew up coming to this house. All the family events, I remember playing here and I have so many, so many memories here. It's just so nice. So um, I'm gonna have some coffee right now and then we're gonna get going. So this is the restaurant. to this place called Casa 1800 so it's like 1800 house and they have like the best food I've had in a long time it's a very nice place they have like authentic Salvadorian food and then they also have like the view of the volcano I'm hanging out with my cousin and then some family and then now we're gonna go walk around and probably go to the lake We're going to take the direct flight from San Salvador to Orlando, which is so nice that now there are direct flights. When we came, the direct flights hadn't started yet, but they just started, so I'm so happy. And we're going to head on over to the airport in a few minutes. My cousin is dropping us off. We are flying standby. It looked like there were nine open seats, so we should get on with no problem. And we're number one and number two on the standby list. So I'm just going to end this video here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if it's your first time here, and I'll see you guys over in my next video. Bye guys.